Amen. You have any opinion? People, they just want to hate you. And I don't understand. Like, since when there's only two opinions that are fighting each, fighting each other and we have to choose between one or two? And this is a reason why I'm not... I'm, this, is why, this is a reason why I'm a Buddhist. Because in Buddhism, there's books and there's the sayings and you 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 they let you read and appreciate and um they let you interpret the sayings the way you want and this is how i work with religions i i take christianism uh uh islam buddhism and and others and I make and I take the things that I'm interested in. Cause I don't I don't I don't follow dogmas. And even like in anything, even musical genres, people ah Kizomba has to be like this, Kizomba has to be dance. Leave me alone. There was a girl uh, in on the Instagram. Um, very true. Changing your mind is called growth. I completely agree. Uh, you know, somebody, um, so wait, 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 let me show you, let me show you this video. So it's a video that, um, a girl sent me, uh, let me see if I have it, is it this one? No, 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 there it is. So this is a video that, um, it's a it's a girl. Uh, she's a dancer. She po she posted on Instagram. Then it was reposted on a, on, a, on on one on one video, and uh, so she. I really love what they did on my song, and I asked them, "Hey, I would love to play this on on. I would love to post this on my YouTube. I would love to post this on my Instagram. Can I?" And she was like, "Oh, of course. It's a, it's an honor." Da, da, da. So they gave me that video, and I'm gonna play it, and then I'm gonna l read to you. Um, something that i found very interesting in um, the reaction of the people
you know, great video. Uh, I love the way. No, we all want to see that. So I love the way they dance. I love the way everything. So of course, you know, uh, first of all, I, w I needed to do uh, who 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 did this 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 remix of the song so I could release it. Actually, I'm releasing it next week, and uh, you know, I was just there, like enjoying the music and and happy that that this compa guyad version of my song something going on got released and then uh, people start tagging me in the comments everywhere and what was interesting in there is that the people instead of enjoying the music they were fighting in the comments there's a there's a thread with 300 answers instead of enjoying the music instead of enjoying the beauty of what we can do artistically what people were doing of course they were fighting about is it compa is it kizomba is it zook are they dancing compa are they dancing zook are they dancing kizomba uh, uh, is is the music is K shot and everybody was tagging me like and I was like what the fuck is wrong with people can you not anymore enjoy music enjoy seeing two people two talented people dance and what the Angolans have to come everywhere and say this is Kizomba and the, the Haitians have to go and say no this is Kampa and I was like what is wrong with all these people and everybody was tagging me everywhere because it's my song it's a remix of my song so everybody yeah tell them that it's kizomba well actually when i did the song i didn't like kizomba was not even a word at that time that was that popular it was out there in angola we back then we would call this cabo zook or zook r b so the name changed depending on where you are and then is it a uh, 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 Kizomba never came first. Kizomba came from uh, uh, inf Kizomba was influenced by Zook. Zook was created after Kompa, influenced by Kompa itself. And Kizomba is a mix of of Zook and 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 Semba by the inventor of Kizomba himself. And then you have the the, the style of music, and then you have the dance. But I was about to say all this and try to teach people. But then my answer to everybody was, I answer to everybody, um, you guys enjoy the music and stop your nonsense debates. You guys cannot even enjoy stuff anymore without trying to nationalize everything. And then you want Africans to be strong. You want Africans, you want us to be able to stand on our own. But every time one of us do something, everybody's here fighting about it. And you cannot just appreciate and give support. Whatever, you can be on Golan. We don't care that you want everything to be Kizomba. You are on Golan, great, but you're African. You are also an African and the Haitians, the, 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 the Guadeloupe, the Martinique people. Yeah, they are your cousins. They are your brothers. So you have to support them in what they do and not come here, yeah, us, us. No, you have to also be able to say, yeah, all of us, because that's how you are strong. You talk about unity all the time, but when it's time to, when it's time to unite, everybody wants to take their own stuff. Listen, Congo, Congolese music has inspired music for the last 50 years. Coupe de Calais, Nigerian music, all these music, they, they have a little bit of inspiration from the great Congolese artists like Kofi Olomide, like Awilo, like others. And But when we listen to Coupe de Calais, when we listen to Davido, when we listen to all these people and we hear the influences that all these people, because of course music travels, we hear the influences, but we don't go everywhere yelling it's ours. Oh, there's a little bit of our thing in there. We don't care. We're just happy to see Africa win. And as long as nobody come with this 
this way of thinking, we're not going to go nowhere because everybody come and they go on Instagram and all they want to do comments. And the worst part is the people who do the comment, they are not even informed about what they are yelling about. They don't know the history of Kompa. They don't know the history of Zook. They don't know the history of Kizomba. They don't know all that. They just want to come and repeat what somebody told them. And don't, they don't even know if it's true. But they are just, this is my truth. And it cannot change. 